What's up everybody, welcome back to Need That Gaming. My name is Ronald, this is the best channel that nobody watches except a few special people like yourselves. And today we're gonna be continuing our Eastern Roman campaign in Europa Perdita plus uh, Fall of the Eagle, which is an overhaul mod for Total War Attila. Boom, be right back. Apologize for that. There was somebody knocking at the door. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and um, yeah. fight this one. I, if I remember correctly, I think these guys were rebels. Armenia cancelled. Yeah, rebel army. Okay. Now Armenia cancelled their uh, trade agreements with us. I have to pay attention with the Easterners right now. With Armenia and with the. Um, Sassanid Empire. I think I'm gonna try an attack in uh, Africa after this one. Let's just see what's what. I wanna also check the, um, the campaign objectives. Okay, let's see. They spread their forces into three. Mm hmm. Okay, where do I have towers? I have one, two, three towers, which is good. I have an extra hole. Like, okay, we have five holes here. I have six melee infantries, so I could plug all the holes, but that would be a very fragile. It would be a fairly fragile defense, in my humble opinion. Granted, I don't think they're gonna come in both ways, so I might use one of the troops to um, flank them. <clears throat> And the problem is also that two of my troops are not fully established, not fully, not fully charged. Hmm. I might go to plug. Yeah, I th think I'll go for that option. And then we'll see. We're gonna be. We're gonna try to be fairly responsive, fairly reactive, I should say, to what uh, they are doing. Okay, let's put them in one control group. They have swords here, I should probably put a, this guy here. Yeah, I don't have two spears. I don't want to put any... Like, this would be cool to put here, and then archers on it. The only problem with that is that if I want to fall back, or if I want to send reinforcements to this region specifically, then I'm gonna have to go all the way around. Or abandon that post. But I don't think these guys are gonna be having trouble with uh, what they have here. So, I'm gonna leave it like that. Yes. Then we got two more archers. These archers are kind of useless unfortunately I'm gonna put them here 
because once they attack there, hopefully, I will go around and shoot them in the back. Right, right. Okay. Um, I think that's it, and we have to be, yeah, super, super. Gotta pay attention. Okay, looks like they're not coming here. Actually, I have enough men there. I'm just gonna keep these guys as a flanking force. I'm gonna keep those swords there as a bodyguard. To the um, actually, I should send one of these guys here. Trying to take out our general! Defend him! Yeah, these guys are on hold there. I actually think I can move these guys away, but let's keep them there for a while. So far, so good. It's a shame I don't have a horse unit. Yeah, I don't have to move anything anymore. We are winning. I can go a bit faster. soon be dead. We can kill a decent amount of them if we get a good charge. The problem is that the slingers are hitting our back, at least that slinger, but yeah. Whatever. Oh yeah. That's that. the skirmishers fight each other yeah you see this this is what I was talking about anyway now it's a matter of time The day is 
yours. I can't run them down with my archers because they themselves were slingers, so I don't think I'm gonna be I would have been able to run them down. It's a shame I didn't have a horse in there. That would have made such a massive difference. It is what it is. Uh, we push down another rebellious force. Let's see what else we can do around here. Hey now. And then another. Oh, this should be. This should be very doable. <laughs> like this eastern campaign and probably the western campaign as well or even more than the eastern one is very heavily reliant on battles such as this and you spend a lot of time on battles such as this and most of the times you have to fight them manually because if you auto resolve you might won win the first one but the second one you won't because uh, the AI will grind down your units and um, the auto resolve is not as efficient as uh, you're actually playing it okay so let's see I think that's all right because they had three yeah yeah that's that's all Well, first things first. Spear here. Spear here. I wanna find a way to use the archers. So, with that in mind, I'm gonna do a defense like this. I'm gonna let them come in a little bit. That's what they want. Because then I can put the archers here. And they can actually hit something. Because of the elevated ground on which they are standing. Um, but yeah, that's about it. What do I have left? I have one one, okay. I can put this here because I don't intend on falling back all the way and these archers will be a little bit... Ah, it's pointless. No, it's pointless. So we're gonna remove this. Just put the archers here and then if they shoot, okay, if, then not, if not then, well, it is what it is. Okay, let's go. I'm gonna keep a couple of melee troops in reserves, in the reserves, in the reserve, in the reserve, right? What's the proper term? Stop being stupid, please. Hello, hello. Okay, we can't see the path. God damn it. Oh, that's gonna be annoying because I have to be careful with the. With the range of the tower. The enemy draws near. Come on, give them one round. Good, good, good. Maybe another? No.
see if this works. these guys in position it's not gonna be a massive problem though come on throw your shit at them Once these guys are gone, I'm gonna put them into the Caesar and Testudo. Yeah, you can. Come here. No! God! Fucking damn it. I thought I was. Ah. Uh. Hurry up, boys. God damn misclick. Fucking hell. God damn it. Shit. Sorry about the language. Fucking disaster. Uh. Okay, I'm gonna abandon these archers. I'd rather abandon the archers than the swords. Ah, what a blunder. Massive and stupid blunder. The refuses to admit defeat. Their unit as our men flee the field of battle. This is a shameful display. It is indeed. Yours to command. Secretary! Shoot them fire! We await your command. Actually, you stay there, you stay there. It's fine. I'll flank with these two forces. Try to close the gap there. We're running against their general. Which is pretty good. And expected. I'm gonna keep these guys here. So that uh, the tower is in... Uh, Basically, the tower is safe. Enemy forces have destroyed an entire unit. Hey, their general is routing. bit conflicted of actually pushing out with this troop because they have so many skirmishers that can uh, mess me up that I just don't think it's worth it
Okay, I think we can go fast because that's that. That was like, these two troops are completely my mistake that we lost them. I misclicked. Oh well, shit happens. Yes, let's get some money. Hello, hello again. Uh, Sinope. Okay. Let's get it on. Get it on the flow. Get it, get it on the flow. What? For a second there I was thinking about sallying forth, but they have cavalry and I don't, so I'm not gonna. Uh, the reason why I was considering to do that is because in an open field I could make better use of my archers. But at the same time, looking at their composition, they could do some serious damage to my troops. More damage than if I keep them in the city. So let's just keep them in the city and do what we shall, or do what we must. these Caucasian rebels okay all of them in one place oh beautiful straightforward and easy just like these Caucasian bread bulls uh, sisters I can flank okay they might also yeah try to be funny Let's just hold up. Actually, don't hold. Like, if they come this way, we can set up a nice angle here between these three troops. And if they don't, well, then it's pretty easy. Barely an inconvenience. Um, we're gonna flank them. Let's check out their troops. Oh, pretty. <laughs> Rudimentary. I wanted to say that these guys look like old school Romanian uh, peasants. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's go on heavy. Let's leave them. Give me one good volley. Give me one good volley, man. That's good, that's good. Maybe another? But they also have a volley, so let's go into the te defensive testudo. Time to go. I'm gonna take damage from their skirmishers shooting me in the back, but if I catch if I can catch all of this then it doesn't matter.
refuses to admit defeat. Their unit has rallied. Oh yeah, that's a good one. We're gonna make these guys the uh, target for the skirmishers. Well, my other men are gonna butcher these guys. Let's make these guys charge as well. Put on the pressure. Okay, the general is dead. Good. This time, let's try to run them down. Yeah, I think the skirmishers are gonna catch some of them. Yep, yep, yep. Good, good, good. While we mess around with those guys. The enemy are losing ground! Concealed units. Oh, yeah. Praise the gods. Your victory is moments away. Okay. Let's see the results. Yes, that's a very good result. I did lose 200 of them, but in exchange, I got a thousand. I think I would have gotten like, I don't know. Not sure the trade was worth it. I will never know unless I fight it again and instead of chasing down the troops or flanking them, just turtling up in the base. But at least it's a little bit more of a proactive defense and it's different than uh, what usually goes down. For you better not be weaseling around, my man. had enough rebellions we don't have time for that anymore <sighs> okay yes let's start by region see what's what first off actually let's start by neighbor 
deteriorating cultural, religious, and political aversion. Treaties with Lahore. Okay, so you don't, you really don't like these guys, and they don't like me. Yeah, like so, like nobody likes me because these guys hate each other. Where does this leave the Sassanids? Yeah, I think this this must be scripted or something. The door is open to you, but if you wish to go beyond the court, welcome, honored emissary. Speak, and I will answer with my master. Let's leave it at that. Ready for battle. Gonna have a rebellion here. Let's focus on Africa for a second. Try to stabilize this region. I mean, food is currently not an issue. Not sure this is worth it though. we're gonna be fighting a rebellion there because there's not much else I can or I should say there's not much else I'm willing to do let's say it that way religious differences of course let's not do that right now let's see if there's uh, repairment or repairing to be done Anywhere. We have growth here. Okay, first repairing. Okay. We got growth. What's the issue here? Oh my, those religious differences, surely. Could get more money. 1.2, 1.8, 1 1.6 and food, if we get the resources, to go for some sort of stability here oh I can still go for this well okay then there goes our money How may I mm. ready for orders commander for orders at your command come 
Could use this army in the in the west. That leaves me open to a lot of other things. Let's see if we can get some Greetings, trade. Friend. Uh, I will do you will the honor. trade with me right now. We will gladly listen to your offers. You have my attention. Now. Yeah, I'm gonna start sucking up to some of these Sick factions friend. in order to and get some strong. trade, because like it's a very quick improvement in the financial we standings. If we're gonna be able to get some trading with them. Even if I have to spend a decent amount of, in the name of the state, money. Welcome. Like I think which faction was the closest to actually seal the deal with me? We have need of talk, I'm yeah. sure. We the also get and need the Armenians. Let's make that of our focal point next turn. your command <clears throat> oh I need to go and try that although it might be very damaging I'm gonna have to try Commander. it anyway let's get a couple of these swordsmen because all I can use properly would be the swordsman. At least let's try to grind them down. Them cower Rome. Oh my god, why does it take so long? That's outrageous. Uh, well, whatever. None will escape. I'm not getting attrition, so I can wait it out. Oh, 20, no, 90, 19. Yeah, are there any more rebels that I could get? I, I guess I could take another spear. I think I'm gonna get another Sorry, spear. Sorry. They might be inclined to attack me right now. For death and honor. <sighs> So we'll see. We'll see what's cooking there. Ready for orders. At your command. Ready for battle. At your command. Should probably go for Thessalonica. Don't let this rebellion grow for a couple of turns. Yeah, let's end the turn. Maybe the African faction will attack us, which would be good. And let's focus on uh, trade agreements. So that if we increase our income with a thousand or so gold. Yes, they're coming for us. So. They might completely destroy me. I don't think so, but there is a possibility for that. But even so, there's no immediate threat by doing this. I'm just gonna grind them down. They're gonna probably grind me down as well, but let's see. They are the ones that have to come towards us, because they attacked us. Now, if I'm lucky and it's not gonna be an open desert field... Oh my god, look at the, man, the, the number of camels there, but we have enough spears. And we have more swords than them, which makes me slightly optimistic. Yeah, I sh I, I don't want to be too cocky, but there's a good chance that we're going to get fucked up. <laughs> no, that we're going to win. Let me see. There's a slight elevation here. Slight elevation there, yeah. Then 
have a couple of horses. Are they running? Are they getting tired? No. Oh, these guys look badass. <laughs> look at those African desert warriors. Now, if anything, their archers might be scary. I mean, historically, This region had some incredibly strong archers, but that was many, many years ago in, anti in, 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 in the Bronze Age, so who knows, who knows. Okay. By all means, we took care of these guys. Turns 
to the battle. Hello. Our men have given up and are running for their lives. Ah, fuck! They're gonna eat that charge. Turn back, turn back. Oh, I misclicked again. The men are broken and running for their lives. Okay, we broke those guys. Good, good, back, good, back, good, back. Our forces have found their courage. Back to the fight.
okay, we're winning this. Cool. We have them completely surrounded. Come on, man. Our men have given up and are running for their lives. Enemy units have rallied and returned to the battle. Finally, victory. This is your day. I think we can run down a few of them still. Okay, that's a great. Hey, hello. What you doing? Where you going? Let's catch these guys and then I can move along. Ah, oh, these guys are very tired. That is actually okay. We lost a thousand men, but we killed three thousand two hundred fifty-eight. Eight, eight, eight. <laughs> Just pretty good. Now their army is destroyed. They might have some skirmishers in the garrison, but that's that. So I can even auto resolve the siege battle when I have uh, the siege equipment. to have another army what are you doing this is a joke okay i'd like to save and auto resolve this one but just in case i lose more than i don't know a hundred men i'll have to manually play it unfortunately no that's fine that's fine kill the bastards They're back for round two. If I lose more than a hundred, I play it. doing this but it helps me save time
Where's the blood? Oh wait, I don't have the DLC. <laughs> See, I can go. Okay, loyalty secured. That's fine. No problem. I got no problem with that. Everybody that opposes us is our enemy. And hence shall be put to the knife. Easy peasy Japanesey. Okay. <sighs> right. I said I'd like to get uh, trade agreements, right? There was these guys that offered a decent amount of, of money. Talk, I'm sure. So you don't want to trade, okay? Let me give you some cash. Like 2,000 would make you barbarian happy. Good, 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 good. Who are you? Oh, you're probably... Yeah. Be most welcome. Your words will find an attentive audience. Nice. I guess you don't want to. Fair enough. Greetings, friend. We will speak together of whatever you wish. Let's put another but zero here. That can warm out. Hmm. Okay, let's keep that in mind. Let's see if I can get other trade agreements for my money before we insist. The day's greetings there. to you. Speak, for you have my attention as the ear of the August. And I'll give you a thousand. Okay, no. How about 1.5? Nice. Oof. Is there no one else? We got the Danes, Armin. Yeah, yeah, yeah let's Welcome, do this. I need, I need minister. this. Speak, and I will answer with my master's voice. Good. That is good. Because just because of the. Um, good the, and noble um, friend. What an honor you do us. Come speak so that the relationship between us words. and them. Beautiful. So we have the Danes left, and these guys, I think, for trading. I don't know what's going on with the Danes. Let's have a look. We will gladly listen to your offers, but do not wrap them in lies. The spirits know truth. No. Okay. Okay. So overall, that's pretty okay. Like it, it significantly increased our income from eleven hundred something to almost fourteen hundred, fourteen thousand. Sorry. Um. Yeah. To victory! We have to wait one more turn. Yeah, they're depleted. I'm gonna auto resolve. There's no point in uh, doing anything other than that. Right. So we're gonna have a rebellion in Libya. The garrisons are prepared. In a couple of turns, we're gonna have a rebellion here as well in the Peloponnese. Or I shouldn't say Peloponnese. The Peloponnese were already have one. <laughs> That's so funny. Okay, these guys have an army out of nowhere. Commander. Yeah, I want to mess around with the on the Eastern Roman separatists. Your oh, they're right here. Nice. I'm gonna let them grow. Why are you suffering of attrition, mister? Ready for battle. Oh, because it's winter. Yeah, so we're gonna let them grow big, nice, and fat. Um, 
I'm gonna have a rebellion here as well. <laughs> it's like uh, the, the thing is that it's a trade-off, you know. It's either I. Yeah, it's either I have money and no public order, or I have public order and no money. I'd rather have money because I can handle the rebellions better than the lack of money. No money, no armies, which means I'm gonna be extremely fragile. And I th think that's it for this one. We hunger for battle. I could go and take these guys out. And then, uh, but I don't have a... Oh, I do have a garrison here. No, oh, wait. No, I don't have a garrison here. Once I have a garrison here, I can... I'll have a little bit more freedom. And then I can... Uh, start getting back all of Greece. So we still have the Danes Return and... Return to your people and prepare them for death. That is now <sighs> your only duty. I'm curious if the Armenians will join them. Yeah, they did. So I think this is. There's no way this is not scripted, because no matter what I do, they're gonna be at my doorstep. I might have to pull the army from Africa more into more into Asia but I still have to finish off that faction there I mean I do have the money to recruit another army maybe I should start doing that Ugh, I just wasted 4,000 gold on my trade agreement with uh, Armenia. Okay, we need another army. Whatever. These things are so useless. <sighs> okay. So where do I have a recruitment facility? Yeah. Makes sense. Let's recruit another. Why can't I... Uh, get foreigners I'm gonna get that guy because he has less influence so hopefully he will be easier to push around it is a great and glorious thing to die for Rome. yes it is Right. Let's spend some money. Greetings! Speak plainly and without idle purpose, and all will be well. A sure thrust track. You are welcome. 
Although my ancestors and people expect talk with purpose and honesty. Okay, then. can recruit an army faster if I get another general here and start recruiting men from Nicomedia as well like I can have my army in like two turns instead of four Ready for battle. so I'm gonna have my spears from there let's get some swords from here Okay, that's that. Oh, we actually have a region that is in the group of Gree. Imagine that. Rebellion here next turn. A couple of turns we have already a rebellion here. Okay, so we have a garrison here, which Ready means I can. Which means I'm gonna move out. We hunger for battle. Ready for battle. For death and honor. March. I'm gonna manually fight this because I don't want to lose men. Be right back.
make it dry. Thank you. I'm guessing they're not gonna come for us, but if they do, let's put this up here. Oh, I still have mercenaries in this army. That's fine. some serious cavalry here. <laughs> okay, looks like they are coming towards us. Which is good. Okay, okay. Not bad, not bad. They do have a decent amount of cavalry considering the size of their army. Trying to take out our general! Defend him! Enemy units have rallied and returned to the battle! The enemy are losing ground! Oh yeah, that's it. That is all of it. Let's run 
them down. We are moments away from victory. Okay, lost a few skirmisher horses there, but other than that, perfectly fine. Now let's turn our attention onto bigger things in the form of the um, Eastern um, Rebels. Commander. Just gonna kill them. Hey, you there. You saw that? March. If you have any funny ideas, that's what's waiting for you. What Limitanis or Limit something was their name? I want to see. Yeah. Oh, we're at war. But why? Speak. I will listen. Oh well. Let Ask them come. Mind. I say. Right. What's the situation now? Dog shit. Dog shit. Immigrants. Ready for battle. Well, all of a sudden, there's trouble in paradise. I guess these guys uh, eventually before you say anything, no, found a way to unite against me. The door is up. I can't even talk to them because they're satrapies. You have my. Ah, uh, yeah. Ready for battle. Well, strike first, strike hard, right? Ready for all. Take out these guys. Oh, could you run any further away? I got, I, ain't nobody got time for that, man. Any man who drops out is left behind. Ready for orders. I'm gonna go here. And then from here, I'm gonna abuse these two territories. Keep the fight on their territory if possible. And then hopefully my garrisons will hold up to the rebels. Yeah, that's that's all I can think of right now. To battle! These guys need some replenishment. I don't care about that right now. Yeah, let's check. Let's remember. Let's remember to check. I want to check the objectives, campaign objectives for victory, because this is a unique, actually a unique campaign. Where you don't actually have to conquer a lot, just survive. <laughs> That's what's cool about Attila compared to Rome too, because of the time period. Pretty, yeah, it's pretty cool. Let's see what other rebels we shall need to fight off this time, shall we? Hello. Oh, this is actually a respectable horse. In Dyrachium. Isn't it Dyrachium where Agrippa kind of cut off the balls of Marcus on Mar Mark Anthony and Cleopatra? Ah. To lose almost everything in a naval fight. How pathetic. Hmm. 
Mark Anthony had everything going for him, and somehow they still managed to lose. Oh well. Okay. I don't see any other troops on the horizon, which yeah means all of the troops are here. Now I'm gonna have to eat some scorpion. Some scorpion shots, don't I? Oh well. Just for safety purposes, let's put one spear here. Can you please come here? Please? Come on. One sword here. Then we're gonna put more spears here. I'm gonna put two units, glue them up a little bit out front and put them there. They're gonna eat some shit. I'm gonna keep these two in reserve. Then the archers can do whatever the funky monkey they want because they're useless. Let's put one here for the flanking opportunity. And we're gonna put one more here to just shoot. I don't even want to watch this because it's painful. Come on, give them a good volley. This is gonna be an expensive, yeah, an expensive defense. Fuck. Throw them javelins, boys, come on. Those scorpions that are doing a lot of the damage, unfortunately. Okay, let's go for the for those bastards. Got 
gotta take those guys out. The battle is turning in our favor. Spread out, idiots. Na 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 na. I need to run them down. Run down the scorpions. Absolutely. catch these guys though I think I'm well move it not catching that though Curious the numbers on those scorpions, yeah. 212 men killed. Bloody bastards. Really, are we playing this game again? I'm gonna have to change the general here. Oh, nice. This guy is also a solid one. Come on, are we gonna have a civil war again? Fucking hell. Commander? Ready for orders. We hunger for battle. At your command. Yeah, this is my only option, like Jesus Christ. Ready for battle. So, surprise me, will you? How much loyalty do you got? 
three. Okay. <sighs> Get the fortifications ready. Rome needs good fighters. Ready for orders. Yes, and then I'm gonna need some cavalry. So I'm gonna have eight plus nine, that's seventeen. Which means I need three horses. Charge bonus, let's go for charge bonus. 175. Very expensive though. My god, the upkeep is atrocious. Come, fight for Rome. Yeah, let's do it like that. We had the growth here, yes. Right, we need to convert these. Yeah, that's that. Nice, I don't have vision anymore. <laughs> okay, let's solve our African issue. this yeah we're gonna need this actually mm -hmm. okay so we got some investments to do we're gonna have a rebellion as well shit Oh, they're gonna go straight for the settlement because I have no. Ready for battle. Oh well. Tiri boo, tiri da. What you gonna do, tra la la? Yeah, okay. We cannot do that. Advance. Commander. Let them cower before Rome. Let's duke it out. Naturally, I'm not gonna uh, occupy it. Am I gonna? Well, let's see. I'm either gonna be raising it or loot it or something. 
That would be sentimental skirmishers. But if I squash them in one place, then it shouldn't be a problem. Looks like they're gonna march out. Meet us head on on the battlefield. Good on them. How many horses? One. <laughs> That's cute. Okay, I don't have a, that many skirmishers in this army. Which is fine. their units. The enemy is attacking our general. moments away from victory. Okay, let's run them down.
Whew. Okay. Okay, let's see what our options are. Yeah, that's one. That's gonna be two. Got some cash on our hands now. Don't know if I'm gonna be able to do much. I can repair these, okay. Right, that's that. Uh, whether I like it or not, I think. Civil War is brewing. Fucking hell. Yeah, there's... Civil War. And it's a little bit overwhelming. And it's annoying. And it all started when... Yeah, it is what it is. And I wanted to get another army. Survive until the spring of 420. Oh. Really? Ten turns to repair that. Okay. Okay, let's go for last turn. <sighs> oh, I wonder what that's about. Okay. Okay. Yeah, let's see if we can fight this one back. Do I have time for this? Yeah, I think I do. And then we're gonna we're gonna bounce. Uh, actually, 
actually I don't think I have enough time for this battle because this is gonna be probably a longer one so that's gonna be it for today guys um, and I will see you again next time battle for survival is still very present but we are making progress in Africa territorial wise anyway because uh, like rebellions and such will still persist um, yeah war with Persia with the Persians is it seems inevitable I think it's probably scripted or it was scripted um, yeah and then we'll slowly next episode I always oh I also want to take out uh, Thessaloniki let's have a quick sneak peek I don't know if it's gonna look like the same next turn as well or when I load it up again it's not bad actually we have a pretty advantageous position here uh, one two three four holes I'd like to use this tower as well wonder what the range of this tower is oh yeah there it is so I'm gonna pull back men here that's gonna be two three four five and then I'm gonna have one extra left with the archers and then sh that should solve the problem it's gonna be spicy though guys thank you very much for watching and I'll see you again next time until then stay safe stay clean and always stay strong <laughs>